It's so cool to me. Um, so our Riveter, which is a brand started by these two incredible women who are military spouses, right? So they're married to men who are in the U.S. military, and um, and they move along around a lot. So naturally, then they um, have a hard time holding down jobs because you know the people that hire them in their local communities know that they're only here for a couple of years, and then he's going to be stationed somewhere else, and out they go. So that was the premise behind this brand two friends military spouses needing to build an entrepreneurship a kind of idea a business a something that could employ themselves and other military spouses regardless of where they live fast forward the fun story about this is that about a week ago it might have been two weeks ago um they were just featured on cbs news um their morning show about their story, about their Made in America, about their ingenue, and this bag is completely new. First look, saved for you in the show tonight. This bag is called the Patton, and you probably can guess who it's named after, but first, um, this is a three-in-one crossbody clutch. This could also be a shoulder. It is entirely gorgeous premium leather and heavy duty canvas with this is the signature behind the brand the military dog tag that will reveal um the gal that sewed your bag made your bag toiled over your bag before it was put in the mail to you great made in america success story here are your quick choices before we introduce you to one of the two women who really founded the brand and started this whole thing going which now is a force to be reckoned with um this is my favorite so i'm going to start here this is our olive camo again all leather Strap comes off, don't forget, it then becomes a clutch. Um, then we move into down here, take a look at this incredible lilac check. Lilac check, gorgeous. Then this is our pink, pink floral. And I think you can just see like gorgeous watercolor floral down below. Three more colors. Um, there is a, <clears throat> excuse me, a stripe. And that's called brown stripe because this whole flap of leather is brown, but then you get these like pastel stripes in really heavy thick gauge canvas. This is a gorgeous black navy. And I think that next to the camo, it's my second favorite. And then there's a brown camel, third favorite. All right, the bag should be $168, just so we can put it out there and lead with the really big story. So this is a huge opportunity, and so is it. Um, speaking to, to Cameron Cruz, who's one of the two gals that started the brand. Um, gosh, girl, what is it, like 12 years ago now in North Carolina, you guys set up shop, right? It sure has been over a decade, which is hard to believe. We started the business in the garage with just the two of us and really had this dream of providing mobile, flexible income for other military spouses. And here we are, just like you said, we had an amazing feature on CBS featuring handbags just like this one, which, by the way, this is the first time we've done these sort of gorgeous leather colors on QVC, and they turned out amazing, so dreamy, yes. So um, I'm gonna have you tour the bag. I'm also gonna have, just for everyone's um, knowledge, all of these ship for free. But the bag was created expressly for you at QVC, almost as a thank you from the R Riveter team to you at QVC for supporting this brand that's made in America, military spousers, female entrepreneurship. And so <clears throat> all the colors that you see here are completely exclusive. Girl, explain why the bag is named the Patton, because it's not just a made in America story and it's not just your brand helping to support military spouses. The Patton is named after another great woman who was a true pioneer and entrepreneur in her own right. So maybe that's a great place to start. Of course. So all of our bags are named after famous military spouses or military women or veterans or women that have made an impact because when we first started, we thought, you know what, how do we connect it? We want this to have meaning. We want you to know that you're supporting the military community. Why don't we name it after famous military? And Lisa and I said, you know what? Oh my gosh, behind every military man, there's a strong military spouse supporting them. And so we couldn't pass up the opportunity to name them after people like General Patton's wife, who has an incredible story all her own 
and just these beautiful handbags that all of that you have is, with the camo is my absolute favorite. But this stripe that I'm holding right now has these colors in it that are so fun. There's so much variety. There's blues, there's peaches, browns that kind of match the flap. They bring in that leather trim. You've got some beautiful leather, uh, beautiful yellow and just it's such a fun variety of colors look at this look at the unexpected i'm just showing everybody inside the bag um 200 yes. of these gone 200 out the door it's a three in one and that means it's essentially a crossbody, can be a shoulder bag and a clutch in one bag. 11 inches by seven inches by two inches thick, leather strap fully adjustable. And on the inside, you see that cute striped canvas, but I wanna, I wanna pull this out. Explain what this is, Cameron. So every military spouse maker who goes into making this handbag actually stamps her RRID on the part that she makes. So that RR195 is actually Erica in California, and she made that liner. So she constructed the pocket on That's the inside, so cool. the whole thing together, stamped her number on it, and shipped it back to us in Florida where we put the whole thing together. So this is actually a little scavenger hunt of all of the makers that go into your handbag. And of course, it's on that super chic, black and natural stripe that just makes you happy when you open your bag and it also so gives you the opportunity to really be in there because i don't know if you i've got all kinds of stuff in here it really comfortably fits a pair of sunglasses i've got a full i've got a full phone in here and it's very comfortable it's not tight so this is a crossbody that you can take to dinner you can take it to the barbecue out with friends it's going to be all summer long a great transitional bag from day to night but you're not going to feel cramped this is not going to be the bag that you have to feel like you have to leave everything at home. This is the one that you can take everything with you and still feel ready to go. And of course, they come with those little protectors. You can see oh, I love on the, the navy black. snap, but everything, everything is that beautiful brass, kind of a very elevated luxury brass look. Um, so when you open your handbag, you're going to see that beautiful brass snap on the on the outside. And of course, another RRID right here on the outside as well where the riveter stamped her number um rosie um the riveter you know in that famous yes, picture that she's a right. world <laughs> war ii icon and she really has set the stage for an entire modern generation of woman who is um, helping to feed her family and support her family and in doing so uh, this brand started off with kind of the two of you in a great mission and now it is a fashion force to be reckoned with so girl i'm going to say goodbye as we give some updates thank you so much thank you all right so 300 ordered and this is the camo this is the floral the lilac check um, that's the brown tan. This is the black navy, which I think is stinking amazing. And then there's that brown stripe. Um, speaking, it's so funny. Did they plan this? Because it's so perfect. Speaking of entrepreneurs, great women, female pioneers, pivot to Estee Lauder, the real woman. That was her name. And 